a correction from the previous video. She doesn't have two molds, but three, five depending on how you look at her. In the game files, there's a character named Old. The number in their files is 008, whereas 12F is number 009, meaning 12F's friend already has a spot in the game files. Firewatch Invisible effect is actually invincibility, because her skill does block damage. His skin is the same as that of the World War II Italian Wastatori uniforms. Pillow has his own ID tag. Emperor is not an Emperor Penguin, he's a King Penguin. Being infected not only makes you able to cast without a device, it also improves your understanding of arts from the get-go. Though that could be due to the passenger in his head. She's the first operator to have an English voice actor signs released in the end. This is the first vignette event where a whole story is told among all segments. Unlike Matrock, she was allowed to bite them apples. In the It's Been A While event, there is no explanation of how Xiao Hei and Ko arrived at Terra. They just appeared here. Xiao Hei refers to the Doctor as the equivalent of a spirit in Terra. The Rap Goddess is back! The during language is based on basket. One of her opening quotes is The court is now in session! Which is not something a defender should state. Despite changing shields in her skin, Hanya still makes an appearance in her flag. Despite the six month waiting period, there is one event which sticks to the appropriate date, April's Fool. According to a now known Reddit user, the mobile city of Shangshu might be inspired by the real city of Shongxing. While the Fire Light cast event is so far the only one to be hinted at in the main story. Her statue was remade, this time with proper proportions. With the release of a lonely trail, she is the only character who has all of her skins appear in a side story. His necktie pattern is the same as the coat on his tail. Rhinelab's record of Originium was translated before Black Steel Worldwide, eh, for the BSW girls. Speaking of which, technically, she also knows how to fight with a blade. Not only is his Hahoge the largest of all male operators, it even has his own set of animations. She sleeps standing. If you look for Art Knight's Granny or Grandma, she will show up instead. Why do I hear boss music? One of his lines is a shout out to Pokemon. I choose you! She actually likes getting lost. At first it was those their families were named after the wolves they are based on. However, we now know that's not the case for Lappy, as that is her name, while her last name is Saluso. He likes snow. She has the only line where her JP and EN voices say completely different things. Yagate. Never you mind, I'm just talking to myself. Nyak nights. Apparently, Smash Bros. also exists in Terra. Doctor! Wanna play ultimate? Edition blob here, as when making this video, Winflint files had been corrected. Apparently, he wasn't talking about a well-known video game, but rather a pro version of Frisbee. However, another thing I did notice was how much of a dog Winfleet acts like. I would say that's the actual trivia of this number. Unlike Laterano, Iberian Inquisitors have no laws against sharing the knowledge of their guns to outsiders. If they haven't become the de facto manufacturer of handguns in Terra, it's because of two reasons. Iberia self-imposed isolation and how overly complicated their hand cannons are. There is no in-lore explanation as to why she's a six-star. All of her examination comes as normal or standard and she doesn't seem to have any sort of fighting experience whatsoever. Even in the bet she debuted in, the only scene of combat with her has her been on the losing side against a regular gun yet she's easily one of the best units in the game. Besides Bart, 
there is only one character with a musical cue when entering the battlefield, Ethan. Angelina's designer really like belts. Like, a lot. In both covers of Cooking Titbits, Amelia is carrying the same vegetables, first raw and then cooked. Ever felt like the character songs sound like Disney's Princess Musicals? That is thanks to Adam Goodman, who used it to work for the mouse. He might be a reference to one of Bruce Lee's most famous quotes, I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. These guys are carrying fallout cheese kebabs. When watching records, there are two kinds of responses we can get, either surprise and actual respect for the tactic used, or bewilderment at how such sloppy formations work. Of course, this depends on combat experience. Those with few years of experience will be surprised with these videos, while veterans react with less aplomb. She might be interested in Lina. We don't know exactly which kind of interest, though. All elite operators have a safe where they leave their most important belongings and last will, with each elite carrying the key for it. Given the way she died, Outcast safe cannot be opened. Despite what she constantly claims, she actually cares for her team. However, her friend in Rhodes is not from her team, that being Vibic. She sneaked her way into Rhodes Island. She has a degree in mechanical engineering. Her character song is literally the dream of what Susie couldn't achieve in Victoria, as you can see in the mirror reflection not the shop she's singing in, but rather the cold and sterile halls of Rhodes Island. Despite how known the Lungman profaminity meme is in the community, that hasn't stopped Hypergriff to sneak some… let's just say rude words by the censors, specifically when being spoken in other languages. No, I am not saying them. Between Mountain, Bee Hunter and Flint, we have 3 out of the 4 styles of boxing, sluggers, swarmers and outfighters, leaving Boxer Puncher back out. Her bird companion does have a name, Sir Cromwell. He got dressed like a flower by Myrtle and Chestnut. He enjoyed the whole experience though. If it wasn't for her panache for overreacting and needless dramatics, she would be a very efficient detective. Kiabak exists in Terra. I am not detailing what it is, only that it is considered one of the more foul delicacies in Earth. Unlike his sisters, he actually has a job aboard Rhodes. She is also being taught the strategy by the doctor. She had 24 designs made for the dress used on her skin. Then choose one with that eyes. Okay. This is, without a doubt, the best battle cry in the game. As good twins, they have nicknames for each other. Sia and Jin, respectively. She became a certified nurse. Guess for whose sake? Okay, this one is a bit longer, so it will count for five. We now know the point in time the Sui events took place. By the end of Shun Yue's event, Jen invites Lin to help her with the events in Victoria, which places this event right in between chapters 9 and 10, thus making the lineup as this, with Ancient Forge occurring shortly after chapter 8, who is real before the events of a light spark in darkness, invitation to wine around the same time as chapter 9, and finally, where Bernard winds will never blow, happening shyly before the events of chapter 10. Which also means… The so-called event in Rimbiliton which broke A1 apart, occurred sometime after the events in Chernobyl. This one is not so much a point, but rather a plea. As of now, we have known of at least three characters that will eventually join the roster way ahead of the respective reveals, due to the Rhodes device included in their art. I know W was one of the best reveals we had, and it only makes sense to use the same tactic once in a while. But that's kind of null when the character walks into a scene with a big spoiler literally hanging in their body. 